Okay, here we are once again. Um, we're making the next part of the Financial Heralds 2 tutorial. And the only reason why I'm doing this is because I want to have all of the comments of everybody asking me to finish the tutorial to end. So here I am making the next part of this tutorial. I will say there's going to be no more tutorial after this. There's very, very likely there's not going to be a FNAF 3. I actually never made a Final of Freddy's 3 tutorial anyways. So, or just in general, actually. I just never made a Final of Heroes 3 or anything. So, it feels weird coming back, actually. I can't remember what was the last thing I did in this game. If you can call it that, I mean, shoot, man. Five Nights at Heralds 2, oh my lord. This looks so bad. <laughs> this was made such a long time ago, like... I can't believe people are still asking for the next part of this. Alright, first night, 12 a.m. I don't know why it's taking me so long to get into the game, oh my god. Okay, here's the office. Is there, a, is there actually... A, oh, there is. So if you press space... There should be a... Oh my god. Okay. Oh, camera's a little weird. There's no sound. This, this has no sound. Oh! We got a hero old mask. Okay, yeah, so if you guys are watching this... If you're watching this part, like from the very beginning, um, I haven't worked on this tutorial for two years. So if you're just now seeing this tutorial, this part hasn't been released in over two years. So if you're wondering why I'm so confused, it's because I haven't worked on this project in forever. It was supposed to be discontinued, but so many people have been asking me to come back with the series. No idea why, man. I feel like people at least try to get the hang of coding after like a couple of videos. But I guess not. I mean, I ain't complaining. People want some videos, so I'll, I'll give them some. But it seems like this is where we left off, really. We got, we got the office. We got the mask. We got the cameras. It seems like what we need to do is make the, the music box, right? Is that what we need to do? Make the music box? But where would I put the music box? There's, there's no cams on this. I mean, I guess I could do it in cam 2. Yeah, I guess we'll do it in cam 2. We need to do a cam 2, and we need to go to the next night. I will do the animatronics. But I think I'm going to do that in the next part. Which, uh, I like to say one more thing. I kind of did a mistake. So this shouldn't count as the Finds of Freddy's 2 tutorial part 5. This, this video that you're watching is technically part 4. I don't know, I just did a typo on the, on my YouTube. Because I was looking back and I realized, wait a minute. There's part 1, there's part 2. I couldn't find part 3. I looked at part 4, and it looked like part 4 left off where part 2 ended. So, I completely missed part 3. I know, I'm super smart, but... Yeah, technically this is part 4, but I'm just going to rename it as part 5. Because, I don't know, I don't feel like remaking the whole thumbnail and everything for the other, the other video, so... And I probably already said in the video that this is part 4 or something, so... You know, it is what it is. So if you guys are watching this, just know there is no part three. Part three was completely abandoned. I don't know. I completely it was just it was just completely ruined. Um I'm just looking looking back at the game, making sure there's anything I want to change. Really? I think the first thing I want to change are these cameras. I notice when you turn on the camera, it just goes dark. You don't even get to see what's on here 
And I should probably name the cameras, should I? Should I name them? Should probably name them. Okay, whatever. When I receive in-game costume one. Oh, and it still doesn't do costume one. What is this? Oh, I get it. Because there's no... <laughs> okay, so there's no, like... There's no broadcast for the camera animation. When you bring up the camera like this, there should be a broadcast when the camera's up. Did I actually do that? Um, there kind of is. This camera button. Okay. All right, I don't have to... Okay, I'm just looking... Sorry, I'm just looking at the code. I don't have to do all of this. Let me just test something for you guys. So I'm going to keep this script. The in-game cost one thing of a jigger, you know. And then... Okay, we don't need all this. Okay. Look at the map. Wait, 0 0.2? Oh, cool. There you go. I don't know. I think it's just a lot better if you actually show what camera you're on. I did the same thing with my very old games. I don't know why. I just made it. So that when you put up the camera it's just dark like, like it doesn't even show the first camera you gotta press on one of the buttons for there to show the cams i don't know why it's such a nitpick and i really it's just really weird and i should probably change this also it takes so long to load into the night oh my lord oh finally now I, now I just gotta change this. Sorry. Cool. Now I just gotta change that. Although, I should have not taken... Ugh, I should not have taken the cam, actually. Cam 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 5. And I just gotta put it in their... Their thing. Oh, there you go. I fixed it. Nice. So you just go back into the camera that you're actually on. All right, cool. Cool beans. Cool beans. I have to make that. I think I'm going to fix this. Where is it? This night's menu. Oh my lord. It takes so long. I'll, I'll at least keep it at two. I want to change this to like five. I'm going to experiment with this. Let me see. My God, end this warning. Oh my God, it's so annoying. Just so you guys know, don't, don't do this, please. Don't have such a long warning or anything. Make it so short, please. Please just make it short like this. Like literally, like the minute you click the green flag, just make it show. Just get out of the way already. You shouldn't have people sitting here for like 10 whole seconds waiting for the actual main menu to show up. There you go. That is so much better. Yeah, no, I'll keep it like that. Nice. Alright, that's cool. Now, what is it that I should do next? Probably the 6 a.m., right? 
Uh, it's probably do the AM. Okay, so for the AM, obviously you would need the actual AM. I'm trying to look. Oh, there it is. Current night. Uh, I'm just copying this real quick so I can get the file and everything. Obviously, we uh, we start at twelve. We got twelve a.m. Next costume. Start at one. Um, I messed it up. <laughs> oh my god, I messed it up. I guess I'm just going to use zero keys. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take it. Okay, so let's just, uh, I guess let's just do this until 6 a.m. Nice. So let's make our script. Obviously, we're going to use the when flag is clicked, go to zero and hide. When I receive in game, where is it? Oh. Forever. We should probably name these. I'm gonna put 12, 1, 2, 3, 5, and 6. Just so I actually know what cost of these are. Wait, no. Why would you need it forever? Wait, that's so dumb. Hold on. Now I think about it, I actually haven't made. Oh my god, I have not made this in a long time. I kind, of, I kind of forgot how this all works. Yeah, I don't think you do need a forever script actually. And I don't know why I'm grabbing a green flag. I'm trolling, guys. I'm trolling. I'm trolling. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Let's try this. Three, four, five. Six zero point ten broadcast six AM. Okay, there you go. All right, I'm starting. I'm starting to getting back into the grind. Here we go. Nice. So every ninety seconds is gonna change. Um, one hour, and when the hour is done, I'm gonna switch again until reach six. Once it reaches six, bada beam, bada boom, everything should stop functioning. But we need to code that in. Yeah, we got we gotta code that in, guys. Sorry to say, we gotta we gotta code that in. So we're gonna start with this. When I receive 6 a.m., this is we're gonna use this exact block of code for everything, or at least this is how I do it.
Actually, now I think about it. Um, we don't want every we don't want everything to just hide instantly, right? Yeah, I don't think we want everything to hide instantly. Let's just give it like let's give everything like three seconds. And it's gonna make sense why in a little bit. Because when it just when it reaches six AM, the entire screen is gonna freeze. But we're gonna add like a fade on uh on one of the sprites where it shows maybe 6 a.m. Uh I'll show you in a little bit. Also, once again, don't bully too much and <laughs> don't bully me too much in the in the comments. Because there are so many sprites. This is why you use clones, people. This is why you use clones. Like for the camp buttons, this is why you use clones. So never, never do what I did. Alright, nice. It's already 1 a.m. Now the next thing I want to do is our night one sprite. So pretty much when we win. Gonna show five AM and just because I'm lazy, I'm just gonna go from five to six. Just like that. Oh my god, that's funny. Okay. Gonna call it night one, literally. Okay, let's hide this. And now I'm gonna make a whole script of well, when you win. So when you receive six a.m. Let's change the ghost effect to a hundred. You guys don't know what ghost means ghost is transparency pretty much switch to costume run if you guys do have an animation for this if you guys have an animation for your winning night i guess you can say because I'm, I'm doing it the lazy way i'm just doing it oh five and then six just so the video isn't 20 years long, I'm just gonna make it by two different uh, frames. I guess you can call these. These are just frames. But if you guys want to, if you guys do actually have an animation with, let's say, like, um, like 32 frames or something, you can do a repeat. So let's say you have 30 frames. Let's say like, cause these, these are like frames, right? Let's say you have 30 of these costumes. You can just have the very first costume. So this, this is costume one. Let us show the first costume and take away one because we're already using one costume. So you're gonna repeat 29 times next costume. <laughs> This is only if you have an animation, okay? If you have an animation, just do this, okay? Just count how many costumes you have. If you, uh, I'm using 30 as like a placeholder in this example. So if you have 30 costumes, then use the very first costume and then subtract that by one and then just go next costume you see how it kind of just yeah i know pretty much and then but that's only if you have an animation i'm not using an animation here what i'm gonna do is add a wait time 
Costume two. Nice. Now we need a ghost effect thingy. I think it would be a lot better if I demonstrate the transparency, how it works. Because if you guys know, the transparency is going to be at 100. But if you use the repeat, No, we want to, no, we want this to be a hundred times. And we need to, uh, there you go. Change ghost effect by negative two. Wait, five seconds. Actually, no, six. Yeah, that should that should work. So pretty much it should just fade in. Show and look, you made 6 cm good job, you won, and then it's just gonna fade out. Oh my god, that's another thing I need to fix. I need to fix the hitboxes. Those are like pretty easy to do though. Those are very easy to do actually. Let's see. Broadcast 6 a.m. Oh, yep, yeah, that's right. Um, all right. Um, technical <laughs> technical difficulties, everyone. Um, I forgot to add a forever next costume. I mean, not next costume. Forever go to front layer. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna add a broadcast 6 a.m. like right here, in case I need it. You'll never know if you need it. Okay. And I, and again, I did another... Oh my god. I am so bad at this. You need to, to show. You need to show yourself. Oh my god. Why am I so crap at this? Alright. Now it should work. If it doesn't work... Oh my god. Here we go. Finally. <laughs> nice. Whoa, we did it. Alright, cool beans. Now you must be asking, well, what do we do from here? Don't we have to go to the next night? And, well, yes, I agree. That's exactly what you need to do. So guess what? This this thing right here, this transparency uh, block. Let's add a hide, and then we're gonna have an if. Let's focus on this if block for now. We're gonna go to our operators and then equal. Then we're gonna go to our variables and grab knights. Man, variables are just amazing, man. I'm sorry, but everything here is very important. But variables, man, you cannot make a game unless you have a variable. You just cannot. You absolutely need variables to make a game. At least a functional, uh, the one that functions, you know what I mean? So what are we doing here is after the 6 a.m. thing goes away, it should put us to the next night. So that's the code we're doing here. So if night equals one, a.k.a. if we're on the first night, we should, obviously we should set the night, the night variable to two, because you know that makes sense. If if we're pretty much done with the night and reach 6 a.m. and everything is all hunky dory, and if we're on the first night, we want to change it to the second night. 
I feel like that would make sense. So you would just set knights to two. Then we want to broadcast knights. This broadcast knights comes from here, by the way. You guys are asking or wondering. It's this. So you should have this knights broadcast. And then you should stop the script. There you go. This is the whole thing. Now what you want to do is copy and paste this. Because we're going to do this for pretty much until night 5. Pretty much. So just follow as I do. There you go, just like that. So if we're in the first night, go to the second night, if we're on the second night, go to the third night, if we're in the third night, go to the fourth, and we're on the fourth, go to the fifth. Obviously, we're not picking a six because there's going to be a button to go to the sixth night. So there you go. So let's test this out. We're gonna go in the first night and I'm gonna broadcast broadcast this. So there we have our 5 a.m. We switch to 6 a.m. Let's go off. To the second night. Nice. I don't know if this current night thing also works. Let's test out if it works. Oh, here we go. Yay. Now we're in night two. Also, if we click on the green flag, it should also take us to night two regardless. Unless if we pick a new game, which should take us to the first night. Yep, there it is. Nice. So I forgot to add here. Forever. Where is it? There it is. Nice. Now we're going to test everything out. So we're going to go into our game. I don't know why I picked new game of all things. Like, yeah, dang, I could have just pressed continue and saved us a bunch of time. Just hope that we get through this. 12 a.m. First night. Oh boy. Can't wait to beat the game. And then like. <laughs> literally like 5 minutes later. Or 4 minutes and 30 seconds. Boom. 6 a.m. We did it. Let's go. On to the next night. And boom. There you go. We're on night 2. 12 a.m. We start the game. Or we wait. And then we start the game. Woo, let's go. And then we broadcast again. And then boom. It's just going to keep going until we reach night 5. And when it reaches night 5, don't worry. We're going to add a night 6 version. Just not in today's um, tutorial. But yeah, if you reach night five and your game like like stops or whatnot, it's because we haven't added night six yet. So boom, there you go, third night. You know how it is. Now I do want to set this to night one. Because I don't want people starting on night three when they first boot up the game. So there you go, we have our nights. Yay! No, let's see. I don't. I keep pressing new game. I don't know why. Is I'm so used to pressing new game when it comes to these games instead of pressing continue. I don't know why. I normally never press continue. So pretty much we have our winning for this game. Oh. 
Oh, so I forgot one more thing. Is the sounds. I noticed that I never add sounds to these games. Excuse me. Um, I never add sounds to these games. You notice here there is no sound. Yeah, there's just no sound to these games. If you guys are wondering where you can add sounds, if I've never, like, showcased it, it's, like, right here. There's a thing for sounds, only for the costume, though. So for the night one sprite, this is going to be the sound for that sprite. So if you guys want to, you can go onto YouTube, search up Friends of Freddy's Night Win sound effect or something like that. And then when you're done, you can go to this white uh, YT MP3 and put that URL in there, convert it, and then you can go back and put that in here. So this YT MP3 is pretty self-explanatory. It just turns YouTube videos into MP3 files or audios. So that is like the main purpose of it. So it turns into audio, an audio file, I guess, which then you can come here and then upload the sound. And then boom, you'll have the sound there. Now some converters, like the one I just pulled up, don't work. But if you search up, if you just search up on Google, YT MP3, you will find some that will work. Alrighty. Well, that's pretty much how you make the... Oh, whoops. Oh my god. That's pretty much how you make the AM. Um, This video has been a little short, but I'm going to try to keep it short, actually, because I'm going to be working on another tutorial which was the advance, which was the previous tutorial I was supposed to make. You know, that, that one also got abandoned. I'm trying to revive all of the abandoned tutorials, I guess you can say. You know, bring it back to life. And, I don't know. These games are all really, like, not that well made, but... Is it, oh my god. It seems like the community really enjoy <laughs> the tutorials, so... I mean, hey, at least, at least, at least for the bare minimum, finish up the work that I never really finished. I could at least do that. And the next section, or the next part of this tutorial, is not going to be coming out in 30 years, okay? Uh, I'll tell you that, it's not coming out in 30 years. So if you guys are a little upset this video was short, don't be. Because, like, tomorrow I'm going to be making the next part of this, maybe. Probably not tomorrow, if I'm being completely honest. It's probably just going to be a video for other, another tutorial, but don't worry. It's going to be somewhere this week. I'm going to try to make the events. Either the events, or I'm going to try making the music box. Most likely the music box. Because, you know, you guys wait a long time. Might as well give you something worthwhile. So, yeah. I'd like to thank everybody for watching. The next part is going to be coming out in like a couple of days or tomorrow, so keep an eye out for that. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.